Hello everyone, welcome back to Phasmophobia. So it's still the same day, we need to get a Ouija board response. We were not able to do that last night. That was interesting, wait a minute, let's go back to that. Welcome back. The population like is so low. In need of help. I wonder if there's a new patch or something out that I just don't have. Let's do a small house until we get a Ouija board. At some point, I keep saying this, but at some point I am going to need to buy a bunch of more stuff, because we keep dying. Which is great! Like, I, I really do like the difficulty improvements in the new patch. It seems the ghost is much more easier, much easier, much more able to find you during hunts. Another Carol, Carol Jackson. There's I think this. No reports of violence or sightings, but please remain careful. I believe we had two Carols yesterday. So prevent the ghost from hunting with a crucifix. Detect the presence with the motion sensor and cleanse with smudge sticks. The breaker is in the garage, so I'm going to bring a flashlight, a book, and a camera, and we're going to go and turn on the breaker. We'll listen for the ghost. We'll find a bone. I'm betting the ghost is right here. Because that's where it always seems to be. Not seeing a Ouija board. I hear a ghost though, and it sounded like it was in one of these rooms, or potentially upstairs, it's hard to know. I don't remember these boxes being here, but maybe I just always rock, walk right by them. Where's the light? There we go. Just looking for some Ouija boards, looking for bones. Not finding. Hearing some objects falling. That sounded pretty close. On this floor, in one of these rooms, perhaps? Let's see if we can find an out of place object. I'm walking around with this book out, and the potential the ghost could write in it while I'm just walking around. Though it makes him look terrible. <laughs> Should have brought an EMF reader instead. No bone. Not yet. No Ouija. No out of place objects. I mean, what was that? What did I just hear? Was it one of these? Was it this? Something over here? Yeah, we got some freezing temps. Okay. So we have a ghost in the dining room. And it's throwing around some candles. It's a freezing temp ghost. Let's keep on looking though. Maybe we can find a bone or a Ouija board.
We have freezing temps, so we do... Uh, did we just lose our breaker? I think I heard the breaker go off. Let's turn that back on. Get some light in the ghost room. What is going on over here? <laughs> I'm not quite sure what happened, but whatever it was, it was very, very moving around. Uh, do we have writing yet? No writing yet. Good. The worry I would have is if it's a demon, and a demon writes. Got a hiding spot here. Hey, we got a Ouija board. Nice. But we still haven't found a bone. Did I miss a room? Or is there just not a bone in this place? Like, there's almost always a bone somewhere. But I'm not seeing one. Hmm. This wasn't there, so that's what was making some noise. It's all bouncing around. Did not count. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't count. Come on, do better. That counted. That should have been an interaction. It was bouncing all over the place. Something was. Alright, let's get a spirit box. And an EMF. Oh, what's our sanity? We're down to 68 already. Wow, okay. That's quite a drain. So, if it is a demon, we are huntable. There's no writing yet. How old are you? Oh, not a child. Stop throwing around stuff. Three. Two. What was that sound? Two. Three. Three. It is a child! Oh no! And my god, it got so active. That was a ghost event. It was only there for just a half a second. Too bad we didn't have a camera out. Okay. So we know it's freezing temps, we know it talks. Which means wraith or mare or demon. We're not getting the demon. Uh, it's not not writing for us. So it's either going to be EMF. Or no, I'm wrong. It's either going to be fingerprints, which would make it a wraith, or orbs, which would make it a mare. So we'll bring a camera and a UV. And a, uh, if it is a mare, we're huntable in the dark. So that's a problem. Still no writing. We got fingerprints. Okay, we got a wraith. So we need to do a few things. We need motion sensors I'll just put this right 
I can't put it there. I'll put it right here. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, the fingerprints. You're knocking on the window. I love it when they do that. There, we got the ghost walking around. I should leave this here. That kind of fingerprints. Bone. Oh, okay. Let's go in and find that bone. Uh, smudge and crucifix. So let's throw a crucifix down. What's our sanity? Fifty. So we're kind of huntable. It's getting a little worrisome. Is there a bone over here? Under the car, maybe? If there is, I can't get at it. That's frustrating. Or is it somewhere like right on the other side of this? I'm scared, I'm very afraid. Okay. Bone. Fingerprints. Good. Huh. Let's uh smudge it. We got the crucifix, so it tried to hunt us. Wow, okay. Scary. I grabbed a candle, not a lighter. That would have been bad to find out in the middle of a hunt. That felt like another hunt there, perhaps. Be cleansed. I wonder where that, that bone is. That felt like a ghost event. That felt like I tripped over something. That wasn't there. That was weird. That's all objectives. So now we're just gonna, you know, ask the ghost some questions. See what happens. How old are you? Nineteen. This is a terrible view of this. Um, how long? How many people have you killed? How many people have you killed? Liar. How long have you been dead? How long have you been dead? I think that's 993. Like it's, it's sat in the nine for a while. So you've been dead for a thousand years. Why are you in this house? What do you want? What do you want? Do you want me to leave? Do you want me to leave? I mean, why is it messing with stuff right here? Okay, there's the hunt. Oh, 
Oh, she went right up the stairs. Wow, she's running around. Okay, well. We didn't even turn on the lights up there. I'm not quite sure why they're on. Well, I think we'll leave the house to her then. So, it is a wraith. Oh, can we get a, pic a look at her? When she comes back? Nah, I should have actually just watched in the camera. I forgot we put a camera out. We, 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 we put it out in the anticipation of having to look for orbs and then determine we did not need to. So, okay. Did that give us our daily? Yeah. Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. How about a high school? I'm still a little worried about how to do these big maps. Like our last asylum run did not go very well. Should we try the parabolic thing? I kind of want to. Yeah, we're going to. We're going to do the parabolic mic as our walking around tool. All right. I've got a report that suggests a possible ghost sighting. A sighting. Richard White. Find evidence of the paranormal with an EMF. Detect a ghost present with a motion. Have a member of your team witness a ghost event. The breaker is under the right stairwell. All right. So, camera and the parabolic mic. We'll give this a try. The best thing they did was make it smaller so that uh, we already got some noise. What was that? Was that a ball bouncing around? We're getting 1.5s like in every direction. It sure sounded like it was right in the gym. Yeah. But we're getting 1.5s this way too. So who knows? Thirteen, okay. Interesting. It's moving around a lot. I... Hmm. So my thought is it's either in this room and it was throwing around uh, something or it's in the, uh, the gym. We have not had very many gym ghosts. Or is it here? I mean... What is it that... It's clearly throwing some balls around. It just... They could be in many places. And I'm getting like 3.0s in all directions. 1.5s. Kind of a zero in this direction. Oh, it just stopped, so now we can't tell. I'm unconvinced. But uh, let's let's bring some stuff out and we'll look around here. But I mean, we have been seeing. <laughs> We've been seeing this pattern where um, where the moment we hit the breaker, we hear a noise near the breaker. And then um, the ghost ends up being somewhere else entirely. Like, that's happened several times now. And it's barely any activity. I'm surprised that we're hearing so much noise.
It's not not going to warm up enough for us to be able to know what's going on in there yet. But right now I'm thinking Jim. Interesting. This is silent. There's the noise. Where are you? Did I hear a gurgle? No. Are you here? How old are you? What do you want? How old are you? Are you here? Nah, it's not here. Or it's not talking. I just, I need to find out where all those noises were coming from. It sounded like a, a basketball. But it kind of sounded too loud for a basketball, too. So... I don't know. Like, my impression was that it was in this room or in this room. So let's check that room over there. Yeah, we can bring this with us. Like, it could open a door or something. Would help. Are you here? What do you want? How old are you? Yeah, I think this is gonna be one where we're gonna we're gonna need to uh, to use the thermometer to figure out where it is, because we're just not. If it is in this big room, we're not gonna be able to get a good signal. Give me a sign. Where are you? What do you want? It's going to turn out to be like way across the room, way across the entire building. Let's get a thermometer out here. I think it might be might be cool enough or might be warmed up enough that we can get some uh, some negatives at least. If we see like an 18 somewhere, it's not going to be a ghost room. Should have turned that light off. We could have um, looked at the. We could have looked at it on the. Uh, well, there's. There is one for that cafeteria, right? Like this is what we we should have turned off. Any orbs? Not obviously. Oh, maybe there isn't one in the cafeteria. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Our sanity is already taking a hit because we're, we're hearing things move around. You know? It's freaking us out. So... Uh, thermometer, of course. I'm just trying to figure out how much other stuff we want. Like, I haven't heard a door open. I don't even know. Let's put a motion sensor out. Excuse me, a sound sensor. Like, I have this worry that we're going to get sent, like, way off on one direction. Because this isn't where the ghost is. It was just some sort of physics bug based on our being here. There sure was a lot of it, though. I mean... Th
thought I heard a really curious noise. Okay, it's not right here. It's not in the gym. Oh, I just saw a wisp. Right? Did I? I could have sworn. Not here. Is it in the cafeteria? Okay, we got some doors moving around. Back this way. It's going to turn out to not be one of these rooms at all. See here? It did warm up really fast. I'm surprised at how quickly it warmed up. Locker room? No. It's not here. See, we're getting pulled... Okay. I bet it's right above us. And... The activity where where um, we've been seeing the noises are all really obvious and explainable. If we just think of them as being above us, and we're just hearing it weird because of how the game handles, you know, multiple levels. Now I heard something off that way. That's a little weird and concerning. But I'm going to keep on looking around here first. Twenty-one. <sighs> I, I don't even know. Maybe it's in the girls' locker room. That could be a thing. I keep hearing all these little sounds and I'm not sure if they're the ghost. It, I keep thinking that they are, but I think I might be wrong. Fourteen. Uh, no, it's still too hot. There's a ball out here. That's usually not here. It's in the girl's locker room. Yep, it's even got the door open. So it's not it's not too far from from where we thought it was. It's even a freezing temp ghost. <sighs> but I don't know, we were hearing some noises way over there. Maybe it was just these balls right here. It felt like it was a lot louder and a lot further in that direction. What am I doing? Uh, we can bring... I, I really don't need this right now. We need some more... Uh, like, where do we even put our... Ah, there it is. Our sanity is doing terrible because all these objects have been moving around. Yeah, we can't even see the balls from back here, so. Yeah, I hear you. No writing yet. It's 
It turned its own light on. How old are you? Oh, that's just great. That's just perfect. So it's a... It's a ghost that's cold, that talks, and that turns its own light on. And our sanity is almost certainly below 75 by now. We're about to get hunted by a demon. Let's get another book. Let's get a um Let's get a UV because fingerprints are no. Is it it's Demon Mare Wraith. And that is I just heard something right here. I could swear. Or it's Demon Mare Wraith. So that's fingerprints, writing, or um or ghost orbs. Let's bring a um we'll bring a camera. In a second book, I think. All right, we're huntable. The EMF did trigger, and we left it next to the book, so it will we'll see a um. We'll potentially see some writing the moment we get back. So I don't think I need to bring this anymore. Oh, we could put a motion sensor out there. Just to get some objectives. Here, let's put what we know. We know it's freezing. We know it's spirit box. I think we're about to get hunted. But luckily it's not a revenant. Because revenants are not freezing. So... I kind of wish I had a camera. I mean, you know, a, a picture camera instead of this but uh, objectives first pictures later it just took us so long to find the ghost that uh it could be like all over the place and this is not a fun room for uh for finding orbs because it's got those locker banks right at the entrance If it's a mare, it can't hunt us yet. Not till we're at 40. No riding yet. It's right on us. Wow. It. Got it. I ah, made it around the corner. Good on you. I have on me? Uh, motion sensor. Probably should have put that to somewhere. Turn that off. It's creepy when it opens the doors all over the place these days. I'm just gonna put this here for now. It even closed that door, of all things. Weird ghost. Definitely. <sighs> I'm 
Richard! I wonder if it went through our motion detector. Probably not. We still don't know what it is. That's the concern. I think we're going to have to sanity pill. Just so we can uh, get back to the room and move the camera around. That does count as ghost, right? Yeah, ghost. Maybe we got lucky on orbs. Look at all those open doors. <laughs> I don't see orbs. We didn't even have a chance to look for fingerprints, though. You know, we're, we're just, we're too far behind on evidence. We're not getting our ghost event, we're not getting our motion sensor, we're not even getting fingerprints. We need to sanity up. So there we are, back up to 70. So, likely, it will not be able to hunt us now. 60% would be where it can hunt us with a mare. The breaker is off, so... If we do get hunted right away, that tells us something. Um, so we got a motion sensor, we can pick it up on the way. We want to move our camera a little bit, and we want a UV. We're going to be in the dark the entire time, because we turned off the breaker. Which I think is still probably the right decision. So that, uh, so that we can get a better, better, better camera picture in our, um, of orbs. It shouldn't be hunting us, you know, just because, well, first of all, because it just did hunt us. And so there's a little cooldown before it can hunt us again. It closed this door! that right there we got fingerprints okay no need to move mess with the cameras in hindsight the there is no, there's no phone in that room. Uh, now I'm even more confused. We know the ghost is there, right? We, it, it, it flicked the switch. It was there at some point. Maybe it moved. Anyway, fingerprints. So we have another wraith. We already got a picture of it. What are the other objectives? Ghost event and it still hasn't touched, touched the motion sensor. Because apparently it went across the hallway and is now ringing the phone at us. Our sanity is at 64-ish, maybe.
We don't need a smudge. We do need a ghost event. Okay, well, let's bring another one of these. And a candle. And we'll grab our thermometer on the way. See if it uh, can help us see if the ghost moved across the hall. You know, without without a flashlight, we're never going to know if it hunts. That is something I did not consider. Oh. Uh, we left it in the ghost room. Yeah, thermometer in the ghost room. I'm like starting to wonder about my decision. Was that a good idea or not? So it sounded like it was doing something in here. No, it's right here. We just heard it step. I'm just gonna put this right here. It's the whole building is cooling down now. And then we're gonna run away. I think we're going to give up on that ghost event. I just... I don't want to die. Not when we've already identified the ghost. I would like to get a motion sensor, but if it's just being uncooperative and not wanting to walk through the two that we put in its room, then we're going to... Okay. Hopefully, if it moved over to throw something at us, it's moved over enough that uh, it'll go through a motion sensor. All right, and we're out. We've survived. No motion sensors. It just doesn't want to walk around that part of the room. Come on, ghost. We even lost some sanity just, just running in there. Okay, never mind. This ghost is just being uncooperative. So... I mean, we heard a footstep when we were standing right in that corner. <laughs> I, I would have thought it would trigger right away. But I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it can wander around more than I think, and that's why we we're hearing things when we were over here, thinking that it was that it was in one of these rooms at the beginning. <sighs> I'm just gonna bail. Annoying ghost. Richard, why were you in the ladies' dressing room? the locker room. Welcome and I say that Thank saying it was not a good thing for you to be in that room. Got some pervert ghosts around here. Shall we do an asylum or a tanglewood? I'm thinking a tanglewood. We don't have a lot of time. Let's just get this done. So, Christopher Brown. Prevent the ghost from running with the crucifix. Evidence with an EMF reader and a photo of the ghost. The breaker is in the in the uh, 
the garage. interesting things here. Not yet. Ouija board! Okay. Just like usual, play with it at the end. Loud noises. Something just moved. Another thing. I don't actually see the misplaced objects though, but it sounds like they're around here somewhere. And again, we're not finding our bone. You in the kids room? No, you're not in the garage. You were over here. They did they changed something. They made it so that the ghost is able to move things further away. Okay, we got freezing temps. We have a pretty strong indication that it's in this room. What is it throwing around? Okay, but <laughs> you, you guys are with me, right? We were hearing noises from this direction. Like, I thought the ghost was in that room or one of these rooms or maybe this hallway. And suddenly it's over in the garage. I think they changed something. They made it, they changed the radius at which the ghost can, uh, can move objects or something because we're just getting so many objects being moved so far away from the ghost room. Consistently. Like it's happening every hunt now. Anyway, let's get a book and an EMF. Should have spear boxed, maybe. Probably would have been a better choice. No bone, though. We couldn't find a bone. Wonder if it's like under the car or something. Well, now I'm errand over there.
they dropped this fork here, or the spoon. How old are you? That's great. Potential demon. More likely a wraith, though. We seem to be getting tons and tons of wraiths. Let's just grab a fingerprint thing, a UV light, and that will probably decide it for us. That or, you know, uh, a camera. I wish you get both. But I'm betting on the fingerprints. It did turn off the breaker, though. That's more of a mare thing. Maybe. We got a ghost event. I didn't have a camera nearby though, did I? I did, it was right here. Oh well. It's an old lady ghost. Let's see if we have no orbs. I'm thinking we do. So, I'm expecting to see some orbs. There we go. Little orbs in the back behind the car. So, we have freezing temps, we have talking, and we have orbs. It is a mare. Our remaining objectives photo of the ghost, EMF, crucifix. So, let's get a couple crucifixes out there. Our sanity is um, close to being huntable by a mare. 60% in the dark. We don't have full coverage over the room, so what can you do? Uh, we still haven't gotten EMF anything, even though, you know, there we go. Where are you? Sh Did that turn around? That might have turned around. Show yourself. Attack me. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Where are you? No, it's not an old lady. It's an old man.
That was scary. Did we get a picture? We did. Ghost, interaction. What do we need? Crucifix. Did it prevent um, a hunt before the one we got? No. It just didn't spawn in the right spot. Okay, but that's easy. We can just provoke it with uh, some deeply personal questions. What is your favorite color? That was not what I asked. Your favorite color is garage? <laughs> what is your favorite color? Apparently what your favorite color is, is garage. Do you like dogs? Have you ever ridden a horse? How many people have you killed? How many people have you killed? No. Oh. How many people do you want to kill? I think that was the hunt. Uh, how old are you? Old man ghost. Are you a mare? Are you a demon? It's definitely wanted to hunt by now. Why don't you go to the kitchen? Are you in the kitchen? Why'd you move the spoon? How long have you been dead? Sixty-four years? You've been dead for sixty-four seconds? Is it too bright in here? Why won't more people watch my videos? What's the square root of 86? What's your name? What is your name? What is your name? Are you friendly? Here, I bet we got it. All objectives. And we know what it is, right? Yeah, mayor. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> Must have gone through like all the charges of that crucifix if it didn't hunt again. Welcome back. Let's take a look at our pictures. So, Ouija board. Uh, dude with a cleaver hunting us in the school. Dude with a bat. Or is that an axe? Or it looks like a bat. Just in shadow form. The interaction left behind by the ghost being there. A blank picture. That was an attempt to get to this dude. But missed. And some caulk that we hoped would count as an interaction and did not. Okay. So thank you everyone for watching. Until next time.